Hey folks, welcome to another TK Actions quick tip. If you haven't heard, Tony Kuiper has completed the V6 panel and it's really good. There's so many things I like about it, but in this video, I'm gonna tell you about my five favorites. Narrowing it down to just my top five favorite things wasn't easy. If you'd like to get more in-depth information about the V6 panel, I've included several links in the description, and I've also produced a full video guide to the V6 panel, which is available on my website. Okay, now onto my five favorite features. Number one, the compact design. The new design takes up almost no room in my Photoshop workspace. Tony was able to combine everything from the previous control and action modules into a single module called the combo module. That alone saves quite a bit of space, but he also put the same functions into the Combo X or CX module, which is tall and skinny like the tools panel. Now I place the Rapid Mass 2 module above the layers panel where I can close it when I don't need to generate luminosity mass. Meanwhile, I leave the CX panel open all the time on the side of my workspace because it takes up so little real estate and I'm always using it. Number two, speed and efficiency. The CX module saves me a ton of time not having to search through menus, submenus, and panels, or having to memorize keyboard shortcuts. Just about every task I do as a photographer in Photoshop is all in one place. Blending modes, filters, layer controls, adjustment layers, and web sharpening, just to name a few, are all right there. And when I do need a luminosity mask, the Rapid Mask 2 module is super fast at generating, evaluating, and applying an unlimited number of luminosity masks and color-based masks. Number three, the new stack action. The stack action quickly stacks separate images as layers in a single image file. This is really handy when exposure blending with smart objects. In Lightroom, you can open regular images as layers but if you want to open them as smart objects, they have to be opened as separate images. But now you can just run the stack action and it'll stack all those images together as layers in a single file and close the other files for you. There's also actions for one-click layer alignment and one-click focus stacking. Number four, the advanced calculator mode. The Rapid Mass 2 module quickly makes the entire range of lights, darks, midtones, and zone masks, and of course you can further modify those masks to suit your needs. But now the advanced calculator mode makes it possible to add, subtract, or intersect masks with each other. For example, if I need a lights one mask, but I also want to protect the very brightest tones in the image, it's easy to make a mask like this by starting with a lights one mask and then subtracting a lights three mask from that. Now the lights above lights three will be protected by this mask. The plus button allows you to add masks together and the multiply button allows you to intersect masks. This leaves only the tones in the mask that overlap with each other. It's possible to intersect lights with other lights, darks with other darks, and even mid-tones or adjacent zone masks to target very specific tonal ranges. And finally, number five, the two up layer mask mode. Layer mask mode allows you to first make an adjustment and then quickly swap out masks to see how they control the adjustment. But if you enter two up mode, this allows you to see both the mask and the image at the same time. I find this to be really helpful when modifying a mask because I can see what the modified mask looks like and I can see how the image is being affected at the same time. This is especially helpful when painting on masks. I can paint on the mask view and directly see what effect that's having on the image. So, there you go. Those are my five favorite features of the TK Actions V6 panel. I think you're really gonna like this panel for these reasons and a whole bunch more. And remember to check out the other V6 resources I linked to in the description and click the bell to get notified when I post new tips and tutorials. Thanks for hanging out with me and I look forward to seeing you again soon.